What is up guys, today I have a bit of a different video for you guys and I'm sure that you've seen all over YouTube displayed ads and so I decided to take a look at a few of the posters online just to check out and see what it was like and I found some really incredible posters and displays that I had, I just had to get it. This is of course not a sponsored video, you'll get my full honest reaction review out of this. So I ordered the display and it just arrived and it is right here. So you can see the, the display logo on the uh, on the cardboard. Now of course I think it is um, inverted, pretty sure you can see the logo right there. So I ordered a large poster because I really loved it so much. Um, well, at least I like the design of it. I haven't exactly opened this guy yet. So we'll have to see what it looks like on the inside. This is my first ever display. So let's get started. After tearing past the wrapping from the shipping, we are left with a neatly packaged cardboard box with a slogan on the back which says, who says a small poster can start a big collection. A really nice motivational slogan, especially for first time buyers. Flipping to the front, the package is really easy to open. There is no tape in sight, so no need for scissors. Lifting the cover, we got our first look at the display, which is wrapped in plastic for extra protection. And taking a look at the display for the first time, it really is a sight to behold. The colors are really vivid and the details are well done. So the display that I got is Vader in a samurai inspired suit. The art style of the displate is actually inspired by one of my favorite episodes of Vision, the Star Wars anime show. And it's the episode with the Ronin where the entire chapter is in black and white except for the lightsabers. So this art style really takes inspiration from that. I mean Vader in a samurai outfit just screams awesome. There are a few others with the same art style depicting other characters but I really like this one best which is why I chose it. But as I took a closer look at the display, I couldn't help but notice a slight bent in its shape. It wasn't exactly lying flat on the table, and I soon found out why. The display itself was slightly bent at the bottom, which is the reason for it not lying completely flat. So I will have to get in touch with display about that. Besides the bend, I have to say that the display has a really nice finish. I decided to go for the matte version instead of the gloss because I'm not a big fan of light reflection especially when it blocks out certain details. And the details and care given to this display is pretty evident. It actually feels like you have the original copy in your hands, and the matte feel of the display just gives it that extra feel of authenticity. Especially on a large display, it also gives Vader this larger than life feel, and it's going to be something where I walk past and occasionally just stop and stare at it. Now done with the staring, included in the package are an instructional manual, a wet wipe, two magnets, and two wall stickers which is needed for large displays. Oh, and did I mention that there is some added content that goes along with the display and that for every display purchase, a tree is planted. So huge plus on that front. Moving on to the setup, the whole process is relatively simple. You first have to clean the surface and then stick the wall stickers. I almost messed up on my first one by pulling the sticker straight off, which caused it to curl up and stick onto itself. So definitely a word of warning when installing. I was lucky enough not to lose the sticker by permanently sticking it onto itself. On the second one, I was a little smart and decided to apply it bit by bit, then a magnet goes on top of the paper and the magnet does have its own adhesive on it. Once that is done, you can just mount your poster and it is as easy as that. What's great about the mounting design of the display is that you can easily adjust the position so that you don't have to worry too much about sticking your magnets in the perfect position. But again, because of the bend, it's not completely flat against the wall. So that is what it looks like on the wall right behind me. As you can see from the background, I am trying to build a little bit of a design, a little, you know, a little something for my videos and for my streams. So it is a bit of a uh, setup and as you can see, it's pretty empty uh, as of the moment. So this is really just the first of many things that are to come. Uh, lots of things that I'm going to have to buy and, you know, uh, set up, uh, some old things that I need to bring out. So hopefully it looks pretty good when it all comes together. Now, as you can see from the poster at the back, I really do, I really do like the design. I think it looks great. I think uh, that you know the Vader in that sort of samurai outfit is fantastic. Uh, the finishing quality on the poster is phenomenal. I really enjoyed it, but the bend, the little bend on the side that, uh, as you can see is a little bit irritating because if you can you know if you pay close attention you can sort of notice that 
uh, a piece of, or at least a part of the poster is sort of detached uh, from the wall. Like there is a bit of a shadow uh, being cast. And so this is probably something that I'm gonna have to talk to a uh, display directly about. But other than that, I think it's pretty worth the money. Uh, in general, I think the poster or the display is phenomenal. So overall, I'm actually quite okay. Besides a little hiccup with the bend, I think if this poster came in its full, finished, perfect quality, I would be 100% happy with it. So I wouldn't have zero complaints, but it really is just that little bend that's really irritating and really needs to be fixed. I think the I think this plate has done a really good job in focusing on the little details of the artwork. They really, really do shine through uh, on the poster behind me. So I really do encourage you guys to take a look at their website, maybe find a poster that you like. Now again, this is not a sponsored video. This is really my genuine feelings towards the poster and what I think about them. So I, I really do think that it's worth having a look, even if you're just browsing for fun. It's really just, you know, it's really interesting to see all the different posters that they have online. And it's not only restricted to Star Wars, of course, there's also a whole bunch of different categories and different genres and I know I'm, I'm pretty sure there is something for everyone on that website. So again, do feel free to go check it out. So this has been my review of the Displayed poster. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it gave you guys some good insights if you're considering or thinking about buying a display poster or you have, you know, this is the first time that you've heard of it or you're looking to jazz your room up a little bit. So again, I hope this video really helped you out. I hope you've enjoyed it. Be sure to leave, be sure to leave a like and leave a comment down below to let me know what you think. Other than that, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.